It's time for Monster Tales. Everybody. My name is Mike Rotella. I'm going to tell you about the time I sculpted God for my grandpa. So my grandpa was a very cool guy, old Italian dude from New Jersey. He was pretty funny. And um, one time, I was showing him pictures of some sculptures I did, some monsters and stuff like that. And he said, uh, hey, uh, Mikey, anybody ever uh, sculpt uh, God? And I was like, oh, yeah, Grandpa. I mean, everyone sculpted God since the beginning of time. It's like the most sculpted subject matter ever, I would think, you know, in art in general. And he was like, oh, yeah, yeah. Well, why don't you do a nice uh, sculpture of God for me? I'm like, oh, yeah, cool. I, I, I think I could do that. So. You know, I, I kept thinking about it, like, how, how would I do something like that? How would I, uh, how would I start? And uh, so I, I did this, sort of a kind of Romanesque Greek god, maybe even Norse-looking thing. Sort of how I, I saw God as this uh, tough Thor kind of character with a flowing beard blown in the wind and uh, kind of this cool face. And I used my dad and my grandfather um, you know, some traits that are sort of in our family in, in some of the stuff in the face. So, um, I forgot if it was for Christmas or his birthday or something, I don't, I don't remember, but um, I brought him the sculpture and he was elated. He was, he was so excited about it. He, was, he saw it and he freaked out and he was like, oh, Mikey, it looks just like him. And I was, I was taken aback. I was like, oh, really? It's very interesting. It's, uh, I didn't expect that one. But um, I'm just glad that he thought that, that it was on point. So what's cool is he had this windowsill in the, the back music room of his house. And there on the window, windowsill, he had um, the Virgin Mary, a little sculpture of her. He had a sculpture of, of Jesus. And then he had this little plant. I don't know where he got it, this random little plant in, in, a, in a vase. And he said when he prayed he, on the exercise bike, he would just ride the bike in the morning and pray. He would, he would uh, look at these three items, two sculptures and then this one plant. And he would pray, you know, and, and reflect on the Virgin Mary, Jesus, and God the Father represented as this plant. So he takes this sculpture and he puts it in place of that plant so he can have these three icons, you know, during his prayer time. You know, old school Catholic Italian guy. So he'd go in there and he'd ride the exercise bike and he'd say his prayers every day and he'd look at these three sculptures. And I thought that was like the coolest thing in the world because my sculpture of God was up there for grandpa. So the funny thing is one time I went over and I walk in and they'd always be, grandma and grandpa would be waiting for me in, uh, in the kitchen, usually. And grandma was in there, but, but grandpa wasn't. So, hey grandma, how you doing? Oh, hey Mikey, you know, back and forth. And I was like, where's grandpa? Oh, oh he's back there talking to that friggin' thing you made him. And I started dying laughing because I knew exactly what she was talking about. He was saying his prayers and he was uh, staring at this cool guy. So I was happy to do that for him. And I think it made him happy, so pretty, pretty cool. That's it. Thanks. That was a story about Grandpa and the Sculpture of God. <laughs>